Hello and welcome to the lab here at CEM. In this video, we're going to take an in-depth look at the Oracle Universal Fat Analyzer. We'll cover how the Oracle technology works and we'll take a look at how it compares to other rapid analyzers on the market. I'm going to show you how easy and simple it is to run a sample, but more importantly, I'm going to show you why the Oracle is the best choice for food producers who are looking to take control of their process and maximize profitability. The Oracle Universal Fat Analyzer is based on NMR technology, but unlike other NMR fat analyzers on the market that rely on free induction decay or spin echo pulse sequences, the Oracle uses a proprietary pulse sequence that enables us to do fat analysis with no method development and no calibration. So that's enabled by two major breakthroughs. The first one is that we're able to isolate the fat signal from all other components, removing any interference from the measurement. The second is that we're able to normalize the fat signal. So regardless whether that sample is plant-based, animal-based, or even synthetic-based fat, it doesn't matter. We're going to get the same uniform response. During the development phase of the Oracle, we put it through the most rigorous validation process possible. We outsourced countless certified reference materials, and we gathered samples from all over the world and sent them out to accredited third-party labs for analysis. We compared those results to the Oracle and we found perfect agreement. Whether it was zero or 100% fat or any sample type in between, the Oracle matched standard reference chemistry results perfectly. But we took it a step further. We sent the Oracle to a third party accredited laboratory, Actalia, and they determined that the Oracle was as reproducible and as accurate as reference chemistry. Now that we've seen how the Oracle compares to other NMR analyzers, let's take a broader look and see how the Oracle compares to other rapid fat analyzers on the market. Specifically, I'd like to talk about NIR and FTIR. Now these are both spectroscopic methods that take an optical signal and through chemometrics generate a fat result. Now the issue with this is that they have a complex optical train that requires constant recalibration in order to maintain accuracy. The Oracle has no moving parts and maintains reference level accuracy day in and day out. Now let's talk about sample texture. FTIR, NIR, they are susceptible to changes in color, consistency, and texture. Because they're an optical measurement, the way the sample looks can affect results. The Oracle, on the other hand, is looking at the molecular structure of the sample and is not affected by changes in color, texture, or consistency. Finally, let's take a look at sample type. FTIR and NIR are both specific to liquids and solids, respectively. The Oracle, on the other hand, can handle liquids, solids, creams, and everything in between. It doesn't matter what the sample type is, the Oracle is able to analyze it. Now that we've taken a look at the technology behind the Oracle, let me show you how easy it is to run a sample. In order for the Oracle to achieve calibration-free analysis, two things must be accounted for. The sample must be free of excess moisture, and the sample must reach a constant temperature. That can be achieved with an air oven for high throughput applications, or with a Smart 6, which enables rapid results in three to four minutes. Running a sample only requires a few simple steps. Simply place the sample on the quartz fiber pads, select a drying method, and press start. Once the sample is dry, you will be prompted to place the sample in an NMR tube and into the Oracle. After a 30 second scan, results will be displayed. If you like what you see here and if you'd like more information or if you'd like to see your samples run on the Oracle in a live virtual demo, reach out to your local sales representative or send us an email at info at cem.com. Thanks for watching.